In an election that's been marked by deep and growing social discontent, the American people have now been left with the choice of two right-wing candidates of war and reaction. The fascistic billionaire and Republican Donald Trump is trying to channel mass disaffection behind nativist and racist attacks on Muslims and Mexican immigrants. As for the Democrat Hillary Clinton, she is the personification of the status quo. As First Lady, she supported the destruction of welfare and law and order measures that filled America's prisons with the poor. As a senator from New York, she supported the Iraq War. And then, as Obama's Secretary of State, she supported the bloody wars in Libya and Syria, which have created the greatest refugee crisis since the Second World War. Workers and youth who have supported Bernie Sanders have been led to a political dead end. Sanders is now lining up behind Clinton. I look forward to meeting with her in the near future to see how we can work together to defeat Donald Trump. My running mate Niles Nemeth and I reject lesser evilism and the insistence that workers and young people must now rally behind Clinton to stop Trump. Whether it's Trump or Clinton, the next administration will intensify its wars overseas and the war on the working class at home. The Socialist Equality Party is running in these elections to provide a way forward for millions who desire a future free from poverty, inequality, and the horrors of war. The current political system cannot be reformed. What is needed is a social revolution by the masses of working people to end the dictatorship of the banks and big business and establish genuine democracy and socialism. The Socialist Equality Campaign is fighting to unite the struggles of workers in the United States and internationally. This campaign is your campaign and there is a lot you can do. Support the SEP by organizing election committees in your neighborhoods and your workplaces and at your schools. Donate to the SEP campaign which relies entirely on the support of workers and youth. It is time to get involved and take up the fight for socialism.